A celebration is now underway at the Union of South American Nations in Ecuador to receive the Jamaican letter. It's one of the most important writings by the independence leader, Simon Bolivar. He composed it in 1815 in Kingston, where he was in exile. Former Colombian president and current UNASUR secretary general, Ernesto Sampo, Sampo, opened the celebration for the 200th anniversary of the letter, as well as the discovery of the original English manuscript last year in Ecuador. He recalled that in this letter, Bolivar had called on the people of the Americas to prepare for a bloody reconquest of, by Spain. And our correspondent in Quito, Liz Shurfias, is attending the celebration at the UNASUR headquarters. Liz, it's good to see you. How are you doing? Hello, Reagan. Yes, we are here at the UNASUR uh, First Congress of History. Um, as you can see behind me, there is the Jamaica letter, um, and historians from across the region are here celebrating uh, this event. Some insight as to the importance of this letter. Well, this letter is considered to be perhaps one of the most important documents um, of the region. It was written, as you said, 200 years ago by Simon Bolivar, who is accredited with many of the liberation movements of the region. Um, it was a letter, as you said, that was written from Kingston, Jamaica, um, to the British merchant Henry Cullen on September 6, 1815. And it speaks of um, the importance for integration to fight against um, imperial powers in the region. It speaks of the region. And while really speaks of the importance for unification. Um, it was an important document in 1815, as well as today. Um, it is today in the Union of South American Nations headquarters, which is a regional organization um, really emphasizing regional integration and is made up of 12 South American nations. Liz, thank you so much for that insight. We'll try to catch up with you a bit later on in case there's anything more happening. Thanks so much, Liz.